That was a lot friggin' faster. Okay, we're good. Alright, let's take a watch. Let's go through the ad first. Let's skip the ads. Okay. No, I, I don't want YouTube TV. Okay. I know this is not the best setup, but I don't have the equipment to. Um, get around the HDCP thing right now. So this is the best I can do at the moment. No way, Pikmin 4! Right off the bat! What? <laughs> yeah! a massive Pikmin fan. He's the one because why is this up? Hello everybody, sorry for the no, delay. Nobody the cares, go away. Um get away. Okay. I need to get my phone so I can text him. Oh wait a second guys. Hey Spectrum, yeah sure you can call me that. Uh, just give me one sec, I'm just trying to find where I left my cell phone. Oh, whatever, it's right here. Text the people in your text off of that. I still can't believe they opened my friggin' Pikmin 4. Right off the bat, like holy shit, that's amazing. my buddy Ryan because he is a huge Pikmin fan. He's been waiting for this game to come out for years. I almost said Shantae, but it's new, so oh, it's uh, 
Xenoblade Chronicles. Okay. Um, good for you. <laughs> how, are, how are you doing, man? You doing good today? Okay, that's pretty freaking dope. Yo, OMG, yeah, that's pretty freaking dope. That's still so cool, they're bringing this franchise back, like I love seeing that. The only exposure I've had to Samba Di Amigo was in the uh, Sonic and Sega All-Stars racing games. <laughs> OMG, wait, 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 let's go, yeah. Are you a Samba Di Amigo fan, Spectrum? That's still amazing. It's nice seeing Sega give some love to their older franchises other than Sonic. No, not really. Welcome to Fashion Dreamer. This is the place to oh God, what is this? It's been so long too. Yeah, it really has. Since there's been a new Sama Di Amigo game. I'm uh, sorry I can't make this full screen. I don't have the equipment to get around. Um, put the whole HDCP thing with my um, Elgato, so I can't use the YouTube app on PS5, so I had to access this through friggin' linking Twitter or whatever. Yeah, it's good. Alright, that's cool. Um, so I'm gonna put Twitch on this so I can mute of course, okay. Get myself an extra view off of my iPad. <laughs> okay. Dreamer, yeah, I, I really don't really care about that. Oh my god. Okay, guys, a big game means big commercial. So, Jake, you flying on a hay glider? Nobody cares. Delve into these dark worlds. Dracula's Castle Baggins in this new cave. Oh, it's the uh, Castlevania DLC for um, Dead Cells. It's pretty freaking dope. I wish we could get a new Castlevania game, but whatever. F Konami, right? <laughs> Finally, making Tron 3 with 
Jared Leto of all people, which I don't know how I feel about that because I love this franchise and Tron Legacy. I watched that on repeat, nonstop, growing up. Um, so I would really love to see more from this franchise. I've never even heard of this franchise. That's cool. I've never heard of it. Looks cool, but is it good? Yeah, that's a good question. I like the art design. Um, okay. I have no idea what this is. Oh, it's a Japanese game, whatever it is. Very anime esque. Deca Police? No idea what this is. Uh, depending on the ratings, this might be a pass for me. I mean, it looks kind of cool. I like the whole detective aspect of it and shit, but like... Might be a pass for me, I don't know. Still looking around to see if I can see where my phone went. <laughs> oh gosh, don't you stop doing this? No, I'm not sniffling, sneezing, coughing, or wheezing. Mm, maybe wheezing a little bit. I stopped smoking, so I'm just coming out of my throat now. <sighs> also, is it playing today? Uh, it's most likely just going to be the direct, because it's almost 3 a.m. here. Um, so, but I wanted to get this in today at least, because it was coming out today. So, oh yeah, Bayonetta Origins. Okay. Gets rid of the uh, things down at the bottom so I don't get spoiled. Okay. Perfect. I mean, maybe I'll play around the two of Fortnite after the direct. I don't know. Depends on how tired I am. That seems like it kind of sucks. So you can only control one of them and you can't attack? Who else is here? Uh, it's just my iPad. I probably started this too late in all honesty, but oh well. I don't know about it now. I, it took a little while to figure out how to set this up because wasn't as simple as just open the YouTube app, which I was hoping it would be. Okay. Pretty good. Game looks cool. Yeah. Splatoon DLC. Like Splatoon 3 is... Yeah, Splatoon 3 is out by now, I think, right? I don't remember. Ride rail? What? I thought this was supposed to be hub worlds just going to the multiplayer games. Yeah, I think so. Okay. Your beautiful new oh my god, no one cares. Of Nashua, from full bath renovations to Go away. Alright. Yeah, it's a Splatoon 3 expansion. I'm so sick of hearing about Splatoon. I don't know about this franchise, but 
Hey, good for the fans who do like it. Yeah, expansion pass. Introducing the Splatoon 3 expansion pass. This paid DLC includes two waves of content. The first wave is Inkopolis. Make this splat-tastic place from the original Splatoon game your stomping ground. What'd you say I didn't hear? Oh, I was just saying that I'm, I don't really care about Splatoon, so for me, I'm just like, I'm tired of hearing about Splatoon. But good for fans who like the series, you know, happy for them. But me personally, I'm just like, eh, I don't, okay, I don't care. <laughs> Okay. Wait, so their expansion is literally just we're changing up the hub worlds? This seems like a pretty crap expansion. It's a little boring to be honest, well for me it is. <laughs> yeah, I mean there were some really good announcements at the beginning. I mean I think you missed they announced Pikmin 4 right at the friggin' start. That was kind of crazy. Like, insane that they announced that. Oh, what's this? Hmm? What is this? Oh, what a story DLC? Okay, not bad. Side order. Uh, okay. I don't know enough about Splatoon to even know what that even means, but whatever. Still had a good amount of announcements. 30 minutes of announcements, dear god, alright. I wonder what games are coming to the, um, Switch Online stuff. Yo, what? Oh, wait. This isn't one of the older ones, so this is a new one. Okay. It's kind of cool, though. Like, they're trying to make a sequel to, like, Disney, or Mickey and the Magic Castle, or Castle of Illusion. So that's pretty cool. Or spiritual successor, I should say. I know a lot of people love that game, so this is pretty dope. Is that a mustard bottle he's using? Okay. It's hilarious. Is it just making me want another Kingdom Hearts game? <laughs> oh, it's a four-player game. Okay. That's kind of cool. So it's kind of uh, New Super Mario Brothers-ish. That's kind of cool. July 28th, nice. Oh god, don't be another fire on the... Okay, it's another expansion for Engage, alright. Yeah, 
I'm assuming because of the way I'm running this, it's making these look really bad graphically because these don't look the best graphically, but I'm pretty sure that's because of the fact that I'm running this through a web browser on my PS5. Ah, Crom. I recognize that one. And I recognize Robin, too. Smash Brothers characters. how most people are going to react if they ever make another F-Zero. Most kids are going to be like, oh, it's the dude from Smash Bros. No idea what that means. Uh, Spectrum, what are you... Oh, yeah, what's your favorite RPG game? Hmm... We talking like classic turn based or we talking like any type of RPG? Oh, that's cool. Alright. <sighs> Dang it, I wanna play this, but I don't have the money. I play Hogwarts Legacy. Alright, okay. Control of Destiny. I don't recognize this. Yeah, I have no idea. This is a new IP. Any? Okay. I'd say some of my favorites are Chrono Trigger, um, Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2, um, thing is, like, I need to play a lot more RPGs, I have not played enough, um, Mass Effect 2, I know that's more of a third person shooter, but it's got a lot of RPG mechanics. Um, what about you? What's some of your favorite RPGs? Uh, role playing games. Okay. Look at that child. Yeah, that's been announced for a while. That's cool. This game's utterly gorgeous. Um, was that a shark? Also, sorry about the bot in the chat today. I have no idea what was happening with that. Also, new Katamari Damacy? Oh, no, it's a package. Or a collection. Two games. That's cool. Okay. Oh, hey. I, um, I was going to text you. I just could not find my phone. <laughs> So. But I'm glad you're here. Hmm. Uh, it's already been a pretty crazy direct. They started right off the bat with Pikmin 4, which Ryan is going to go nuts over that. He's been like salivating for that game for like 10 years now. Well, I was like, let me check. <laughs> Um, but Pikmin 4 is a big deal. That's a really cool announcement. And then they went from there right into a second classic franchise returning, but I can't remember what it is off the top of my head. Yeah, I can see why this one is free to play. <laughs> This looks like a friggin' mobile game. <laughs> like, this should be being played on my phone. No, I don't want the ads. 
right back. That's cool. I don't. I've never even heard of Etrian Odyssey, but that's kind of why it's cool that it's a. Yo, it's an old Atlas RPG. What? That's dope as hell. That's so cool. Cause Atlas is like you know one of like the few companies that probably predates like friggin' Square Enix in terms of like RPGs with like um, the Shin Megami Tensei franchise, which eventually went into Persona or spun off into Persona. OMG Mobile Game, yes, the ones you have to exit out of as ads when you're playing your real games. Yeah, pretty much. OMG Cool, yeah. Still, this this is friggin' dope. This is really friggin' dope. Like. I love seeing this, especially in terms of game preservation stuff. I love seeing this. Nice job, Nintendo. Nice job. Nice! Nice job, Nintendo. Alright, what you got next? No, it couldn't be. Oh, that's the remaster. Okay. I know a lot of Armor War fans, whatever this franchise is called, have really been wanting another actual game in this franchise. I mean, it's dope as hell they remastered them, considering they were old DS games, which are at this point probably getting close to being 10 to 15 years old. Maybe even 20, I don't know. Um... But it's like Advanced Wars, that's it. Oh, yeah, so it's my favorite RPG game. Is, it is the ones I have or any, even I don't have. Any. Oh, this is a big deal. There's a new Kirby game? A new story will unfold in the Kirby's Return to Dreamland Oh! Okay, I never played Return to Dreamland, so I actually would love to play this. My favorite I don't have is probably Elden Ring. Yeah. Oh, they're giving this the, uh, uh, Super Mario, th wait, what, <sighs> nobody cares about this, oh, I can't skip the ad, I'm sorry, was that a One Punch Man costume for, okay, whatever, with hundreds of design options, you fit your style, and your life, bath fitter, it just fits, oh my gosh, Okay. Yo, this is cool. This is a whole new epilogue add to the game. To regain Magalore's powers, you'll need to collect magic points by defeating enemies. That's cool. So they gave this the um I hate ads, yeah, me too. What was it? Um uh, Super Mario 3D World, and it's not Bowser's Inside Fury, that's what I keep thinking it's called, but Bowser's Fury, that's it. I'm get, I was getting them mixed up with um, Mario and Luigi Bowser's Inside Story, but it's um, Bowser's Fury. Was the only, so they're giving this kind of the Bowser's Fury treatment. It's kind of cool. I like that. Okay. Yeah, I'll probably definitely pick this up. But I just wish they would remaster a uh, friggin' Kid Icarus Uprising on the Switch because that game is unbelievably good, but it's so hampered by the 3DS's controls. This is still so cool because I, I never played Return to Dreamland. So. Nice. It is really nice seeing Nintendo, like, consistently giving love to Kirby because for a while. There just was no real Kirby games for like a good chunk of like maybe 10 to 15 years. And now we got like a slew of them in the last like five to six years. It's been great. We hope you're looking forward to the new story in Kirby's Return to Dreamland Deluxe. Next, here's some news about Nintendo Switch Online. Please take a look at this. Alright, why are they adding to this Nintendo Switch Online? Oh my god. Switch online. 
Well done, Nintendo. Holy shit, they're adding Game Boy games to Nintendo Switch Online. That's insane. Oh, this is great. This is fantastic. Yo, I mean, I'd rather play the um, HD remake on Switch, but... Okay, that's cool. Oh my god. Can't believe it. Yeah, neither can I. This is, this is pretty dope. They're pretty freaking dope. Oh, the original Alone in the Dark? I've never played that. That's dope. <gasps> nice. Oh, hell yes, Wario Land. Oh my god, the original Kirby game. Back when they had him as a white puffball before they got the pink color. Oh my god, that's so cool. You can use the Game Boy, Game Boy Pocket, or Game Boy Color Screen Filter. Oh, thank god I don't have to play in ugly green. Yo, online gameplay for Game Boy? Oh my god, the Oracles and the Seasons and Ages games are getting added. That's amazing. Wait, what? <laughs> what? Game Boy Advance games have been added to Nintendo Switch Online Plus expansion. What? The Game Boy Advance, including the Minish Cap. Super Mario Advance 4, Super Mario Brothers 3. Play 38 extra levels from the Nintendo eReader accessories. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Nintendo, you did not have to go this hard. Like, holy shit. Mario Kart Super Circuit. Race in the first Mario Kart game created for a portable system. Bro, if I had enough money, I will pay it. <laughs> yes, yeah, same. Oh, sweet, I can finally play this. Hell yes. Oh my god, the Minish Cap. I've been wanting to play this. Oh, it's gonna be great. Oh my god. Nintendo is treating us like they said we going all out, yeah. Oh, Metroid. Metroid Fusion! The original Fire Emblem! The original Evan Fire Emblem! Golden Sun! Yeah, if only we can get a new Golden Sun game, that'd be amazing. The original, yeah. That's insane. And after today's Nintendo Direct, you'll be able to play the Game Boy and Game Boy Advance titles we have. Right now. Dang. Look forward to more information about Nintendo Switch Online. Nintendo Switch Online Plus Expansion Pack in the future. Bro, they went all out. Yeah, there's still more. Oh my god. No. You didn't. You didn't. <laughs> oh, it looks so good. Oh, it looks so good. Oh, they didn't. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, that music. I have never actually managed to get my hands on a copy of this game to play it, so... This is awesome. This is a great move, especially with Metroid Prime 4 eventually coming out. That, my god, Nintendo, you are spoiling us. Amazing, I can type her right. 
I mean, I really want to see this movie, but I don't want to see this ad right now. Yep, okay. Oh, wow, <laughs> yeah. This is literally amazing. Like, this is the game that brought Metroid back. Because before this, they hadn't made a game since, I think, there was a handheld called Fus Metroid Fusion on the DS or something. But before that, as far as, like, a mainstream title on, like, an actual home console, there hadn't been a game since, like, the 90s, I think, with, um, Super Metroid. I want to play Metroid so badly, yeah, same. Um... And so then, like, you know, like, people are like, oh, Metroid's kind of done, like, they're not really going to make anymore. And then they brought it into 3D, because this was the first 3D Metroid game they ever made. And people are like, oh, there's no way this is going to work. And it completely revitalized the franchise. I put Metroid so badly on that, yeah. Also, oh, man, I don't have to play this game on the crappy, uh... Originally, it was GameCube games, so I could have played it that way, but I... GameCube copy of Metroid Prime, gonna cost so friggin' much nowadays. Today? My god, they did not have to go this hard. Put your master, detective skills master detective skills? This is the World Detective Organization. What is this? A training detective and Shinigami. Oh, okay, it's just a... It's a new game. Alright. I don't have the money. Same! So many good games, not enough cash. Okay, so this looks kind of cool. But like, if it gets a huge, really good ratings, I might play it, but too many other games to get through. Detect Heartbeats? What am I, Daredevil? <laughs> Wait, take flight once more. What is this? Remastered collection of both Botan Kaido's games, originally released on the Nintendo GameCube system. I've never even heard of this. After a long and peaceful era on the floating islands above Earth, that's great. That's cool. Like, that's what remasters are for. To bring back old games I've never heard of. Nice. I like seeing this. Oh, dang, it's got, like, that old-school, like, FF89, uh, type RPG feel to it. That's pretty cool. Oh, God, it's a card one. So that's why I've never heard of this. Uh, okay. I mean, card games can be fun. It can be fun to build the decks and stuff. It's just not what I normally go for. I do like the art design, though. It's pretty good. Alright, what's next? Okay. Rose steals time. Okay, so it's basically Animal Crossing if it had a plot. Okay. So I'm not chatting much, I'm playing Roblox, remember I'm still a child. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah, these types of games are just not really my thing. Like, oh, no, there is fighting, okay. 
like these like life sim type games, like farming sims and stuff like that. Not my thing. Okay. Cool. Oh, this is a big one. Dang, that art style looks good. Almost looks like Professor. Oh! They brought back Professor Lake. <laughs> oh my God! They actually brought back. God, you did not have to go this hard. Alright, what course is that they're bringing back for Route 4? I really need to pick up Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Ah, uh, that's a new island. That's of course. I'm happy but sad also because I don't have money. Yeah. Yo! GameCube character! Let's go! Double Dash! Double Dash was the best Mario Kart. Even though this looks like this looks really good. Where's my man Funky Kong? That, that's all you're showing? Okay. Spring, nice. Nice! So I got the DLC, but I don't have the game. <laughs> Oh, what is that? Oh, Mega Man Battle Network. Minecraft Dungeon. Okay, so these are all the ports that are coming from other systems. Alright, Minecraft Dungeons. That's cool. Uh, it's Gearbox, but I've never even heard of this game. Gearbox. Those are the guys that did Borderlands. Cool art style. Looks creative. No. Oh my god. <laughs> Nice, I love that. That's great. Way, way to preserve Mega Man history, I like that. Have a nice death. I've been wanting to play this. This looked like a really cool indie game. Give me really strong Hollow Knight vibes. Uh, literally no one will be buying that. Except grandmas getting it for their kids for Christmas because they see it in the bin as a five-dollar thing. Yes, I want to play Hogwarts Legacy, but I don't want to see the ads for it right now. Ah, oh, darn, almost at the end of the direct. We have one more big announcement, it looks like. Playing gonna be Zelda. That looks like a mobile game. I like one of those crappy, like, Disney Connect titles. That's what that looks like. Yo, that's cool. Nice. Are we getting a date? Are we getting a date? Release date. It's Tears of the Kingdom. Alright, come on, give me a release date. School. It's Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Breath of the Wild sequel. Hands down what this is. Hmm. Yo. Okay, the Blood Moon is just staying. <laughs> the moon is attacking us itself! <laughs> Yo, I hope the map is drastically different. What the frick is that? Oh, that was Ganondorf.
Oh, okay, yep, the map is drastically different. That's good. I'm liking what I'm seeing. What? Oh, that's cool. Yo. Wait, what? Was was that Ganondorf's hand reaching for Zelda's? Okay. What is that? Alright, come on, release date. Release date. Release date. Come on. Oh, we're still going. Yes, that release date. So unbelievably good. Alright, I'm gonna play one round of football before I talk about the direct. I'm gonna have the headache. Um, dear God, that was one of the best direct. That was probably on par with their last one, and I really did not think their last one would. Um, I, I really did not think this one would match their last one because their last one, like. I was practically drooling at how good it was. What? Where's singles? There, oh, there we go. Um. That was, yeah, that really, really was amazing. Um, damn, I'm just players with the Excalibur rifle. Search chest for the Falcon to scout in a single match. Oof. Good headshots. Okay. Mm, also, I almost got all the battle pass. Oh, nice. I'll have to pick up the battle pass soon because I'm almost at 26 and I want to get that Doom Guy skin. Get a headshot. Uh, oh, I, I can just get 16,000 XP just by going here. Okay. Um, what else do I like about the direct? Get the skin, it's cool. Yeah, I will. Um, I loved seeing, um, Pikmin 4. Them opening with Pikmin 4 was amazing. Like, literally, they didn't even have, like, a, you know, like, a, the thing they normally do where the guy comes up front and be like, I have this to introduce them as the, you know, little click noise thing. Um, just went right into it from the beginning, and wow, that was amazing. Um... Uh, the Game Boy and Game Boy Advance games. To be honest, all of it was amazing. Yeah, definitely. Like, I love seeing all of the old JRPGs getting remastered. Love seeing that. Um, just even if I don't play them, but just from a game preservation standpoint, some weren't so bad, I guess. Yeah. Um, love seeing all that. I loved seeing. I loved getting a release date for Tears of the Kingdom. Freaking finally. Like, when that game was initially announced, I was still living in my previous house. That was before the friggin' pandemic. I was still in college back then. Dear God, that was a long time. That was a long last time ago at this point. It's like three years almost. Probably four. 
Can't wait for Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah, same. Um, what else? Uh, Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Color, uh, original Game Boy games getting released on Switch Online. I will probably most definitely be trying to play some of that. Professor Frigging Layton coming back makes me so, so happy. Like, just so unbelievably happy. That is such great news. Um... Can't wait for the Tears of the Kingdom, but they really went all out. Yeah, they really freaking did. Uh, Splatoon 3, I can really care less about. Oh well. Like, I don't really care that they announced DLC for that. Whatever. Um... Where's a weapon? Uh, uh, the new Mario Kart courses look cool. Them adding Birdo in was pretty freaking cool. Uh, Metroid Prime Remastered. My god, that is amazing. That is unbelievably amazing. I cannot wait to play that. Um, like, it's really, oh, crud. I'm gonna play one more round, that was garbage. Um, for a company that used to say they would never remaster crap, it is really nice seeing how much they are remastering. Still no FCR remasters, though, which makes me sad. But that reminds me, the original Metroid 2 coming to Game Boy emulator on Switch. That's friggin' awesome. Metroid was so cool. Yeah, it was. And then we're apparently getting Fusion later on, which... Fan friggin' tastic. Um, which reminds me, I have to go back and finish up Dread. Because I haven't played a ton of it yet. I made it through, like, I think the first boss or so. Maybe two. Um... Really good game. Let me go back to it. I'm trying to think. Was there anything, any other really big games mentioned? Um. Yeah, we got updates on the new Bayonetta game, which I already knew about. Um, I don't hit headshot. Right, I'm just going to go sit. I'll see if I can get this stupid quest done. Okay. Um, <laughs> what other ones? Can you think of anything Spectrum that I didn't mention that you thought was really cool? Yes! I got a hug! <laughs> uh, seeing some old Atlas RPGs getting remastered, that was, that was honestly really amazing. That was great. Kirby's Return to Dreamland Deluxe. That's pretty freaking cool. Um, still haven't seen uh, Kid Icarus Uprising Remaster or uh, um, F Zero GX Remaster, which sad because I'd love to see those on Switch. It'd be freaking amazing if they did that. There's a lot of good ones. Yeah, there really was. That was a great direct. I really do not expect them to do that well after 
how good their last direct was. Like, I did not think they had that much still to show. Like, my god. Okay, max out the shield. There we go. I'm gonna find a Oath Keeper chest, which there was one here and somebody already opened it. Shit. Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Nope. Oh. Well, survived another storm phase. Okay. Just here, so Move on to another area, I guess. Dang it. So there's one down here, sometimes there is. Dang it, somebody already opened that one. Oh, I'm gonna take damage there. Crud. So weird having these. This is cool though, I like it. No, dang it. Um, oh, the Minish Cap. Uh, on the Game Boy Advance emulator. That's, that's friggin' awesome. I love that that's getting ported. Love that. So friggin' cool. Guardian shit? No, it's not. Okay. Nope, not what I need. Oh, there are stairs back here. Jackpot! There we go, 20,000 XP. And then I guess pick up both ringer items, right? Or Guardian shield, here we go. Level 25. Ooh! Um, llama. Please finish reloading. Ah, oh, he's gone. Okay. I didn't know the llama could rift away. It's kind of funny. Deploy a guardian shield. Is it? Oh, okay. Deploy five of these things. So, bro. Great. There we go. Can I pick it back up? Yes, I can. Great. One, two. Yep, this is working. Perfect. Three. Four. I love how they just saw. The character from Overwatch. Also, what's your favorite game out of all of them? Um, you mean out of the direct or just in general? Oh, you have to take that. Thank you. Mm. There we go, 5 of 5, that's done. 16,000 XP, thank you. Yo, Dragon Ball, let's go. Um, yeah, I'll take that, that's pretty freaking dope. And I'll drop that to that. Out of the direct, okay. Um, probably say Metroid Prime Remastered, I think. Either that or maybe Professor Layton coming back, that's pretty cool. 
like if we're not talking, you know, just old games that we're adding to the emulator, or putting on the emulator, I should say. Hmm, cool. Nice, yeah. Okay, um, oh. Oh, it's indie. Okay. Crud. Not good. He's good to not shockwave more the way I thought it would. There we go. Yo, he won the last round and I murdered him. Let's go. Take that winner's crown. Thank you. He's got to be so mad right now. Hmm. Those minis first. Okay. That. Mine probably the. T oh yeah, Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Definitely that. Definitely that. I'm an. I'm an idiot. <laughs> um. Oh, yes, dude's not gonna last long. Okay, there we go. Oh, we got a key. Thank you. To the side, there's a lot. Yeah. Other than Tears of the Kingdom, what was your favorite that you saw? Wait, am I in build? Oh, shit. Build. Who's shooting at me, by the way? I'm gonna demonstrate this side because there's a lot of good games. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, directed. That was nearly 200 damage. Yeah, you better build. I'm about to annihilate you. And into the storm you go. Phew. And phew. Oh, it's fun to play with players or bots who are not that good. <laughs> yeah, you better run. Keep running. Oh, nice try. I see you there. Nope. Goodbye. Circle. Oh boy. Okay, I better go. We hit level 26. Let's go. Just have to actually make some money so I can buy the battle pass. I got the Kamehameha. I don't need the capsule. I'll keep sliding, keep sliding. Oh. Dang, there's only 19 players left already. And it's literally anybody I shoot is just probably automatically just gonna build the Trump Tower now. Oh, I like this gun. Well, I think it is, right? No, it's not. Dang it. Nope. Take that back. Thank you. I will say this game looks utterly gorgeous in Unreal Engine 5. Like, wow, this looks good. Ooh. Um. for now. Uh, dang it. Okay. I need this for a quest, but I want the Kamehameha. <laughs> Let's see if I can find five chests in this area to open before... 
Uh, I run into another player, the game ends. That is not a chest. Uh, no, that's going to take me towards the storm, so I need to go this way. I can get part of the map here. Somebody fighting. I think it was over in this direction. See builds going on over there. <sighs> Twelve other players. Yep. Ooh, that coming only got interrupted. Shoot. Really do not need that right now. Oh wait, wait, wait. I know what to do here. Into the storm you go. I was running on my body in my head because I have a headache. Oh, cool. Sorry to hear you have a headache. I'll this way. Um, where do these dudes go? What? One of them died there. Where's his butt? Oh, I see you. No, that's a chicken thing. It's a pull that ammo, though. Also, dang, that dude just wrecked my shield. Oh, I see you. <sighs> now I wish I had the coming in my haw. Wouldn't really work from this distance, though, to hit the dude. <laughs> I'd shield that be good and just let them murder each other. Oh! That's good. I like that. Okay. Um, I'm not going to do me much good here, so. Maven Auto Shotgun. Let's see how good this is. Okay. Seven other players. Yo, let's go. Let's get that shield back. Okay, cool. We're up to 90. That's good. Um, oh, we might hit level 27 tonight, especially if we win this. Oh, wait. I see him. Wow, that is such a bot. <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh, he had the Deku Punch. Um, I think this building's still in circle. Five other players left. This guy yet? Okay. Dang, that's better than me. Okay. Hell yes, fifteen thousand. Off we go. Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> Not expecting that. Ah, this is good. Oh, I see that truck over there. Four of the players left. Come on. Three other players left. Alright, they all gotta be over there, so I'm gonna start pushing. Because. Don't do damage, don't do it. Good.
Man, I love how I can do that now. That's cool. Oh, crud. Okay. That works. <laughs> oh, okay. That's one way to deal with a car. Other players left. Lol. Yeah. Oh, I think I see him. Yep, there he is. I don't think he's come out of there yet, has he? Okay. <laughs> oh my god, that's too much fun. Yeah, that car definitely flew. Alright, it's just me and one dude left. You better hit me, man. You better hit me. Too late. <laughs> Let's friggin' go. Hell yes, okay. Yeah. And there for tonight, I think. That is a great spot to end it on. 15 battle stars went up 3 levels, nice. Standard, and I got a new glider. Cool. Do some battle pass stuff. Alright, see you, see you, Spectrum. Um, so, uh, thank you. Wait, is that a glider? Oh my god, that's amazing. Okay, um, I have to be level 29 to get that. Okay. There's hundred more V bucks. Yeah, alright. Can you wait for me on the stream? Alright, uh, I'm probably gonna end it here. Have a good night, everyone. Thank you for tuning in.